is Denise from Discount Diva. I'm going to do a Dollar Tree haul. It's like, I went to the Dollar Tree on Saturday, I think. Yeah, and then Sunday, today. Um, I'm going to put a, a part a part one and a part two, not with this haul, but the prior. I just haven't had a chance to put it up. But look out for that soon if you're interested. And don't forget to subscribe. I appreciate it. And the new subscribers I've got lately. Thanks a lot. And those of you watching me for the first time. I do other kind of videos. I was train of thought. Sorry. Um, I do plus size fashion with clearance. I do a lot of clearance shopping haul. With plus size. And regular um, stores. Of great deals that I find. And I will show them to you. So let me get on with it and shut up already and let's get on with Dollar Tree stuff. Sorry I was rambling in the light. My light is bad in my room. I don't have it in the middle of the room, so bear with me. I found this and I thought this would be really good. Like I like to keep track of my bills and when the bills are due, so I write it all down. And this is what this looks like. I don't know if it's a name brand. It says premium pet folio, black notes. And it has, you know, it's practically just a pair, and I guess you keep track of it. I guess some people might do it, like, in their job if they like to keep notes, track of things. This is what I've been finding lately, a lot of movies. Um, I got this much at the Dollar Tree. I like the Yankees, so I was interested in this because of Babe Root. It's called Babe Root Story, 100 Year Anniversary. I'm glad I was able to get it and not bear for a doll. This is a horror movie. Coven, I don't know if any. I think it's being advertised somewhere, so. I was interested in that. And this is the back. I, even if it's crappy, it's a buck. So this one's Blood Moon. I think I heard it. I hope I didn't see it on Tubi. And this is, I love horror movies, so I will always show you horror. And this one's a Crying Wolf. That was a good deal. And I'm becoming the socks lady. So this was from Through the Room. I think these were ladies. Because sometimes I buy men. But they look like they run really good. They wash well. Because I bought all kinds lately. If you watch my videos. And these are good. I'm not going to use these for the gym. Or just whatever. Good with sneakers. Okay. Another bag. Sorry I have to do it. It's easier to do it this way. They had this again, the Mr. Clean Magic Sponge. So I bought two. Because I need it. I don't like to stain on my counter. Because I rent, so I want to make sure it stays nice. Anyway, if I only would do the same, I just don't like their counter. It's one of those old fashioned kind of counters where they stain very easy. This was a great find, the hint, and this one has the cherry flavor. These are really good. They don't have the artificial sweetness. It has like a hint of fruit flavor in it. I highly recommend using it if you're trying to get off a of soda. And I'm trying to do that. And this one's raspberry. The raspberry is good too. They have watermelon, but they didn't have it at that location. But they come in watermelon. This is a great buy for a dollar. Can't beat it. I'm going to bring it to the gym. Like afterwards when I want to drink some. Yeah, I came across the sauce spa. I bought this before. I bought the refill because I have like a dispenser I recently bought. It might be my other haul. Or it might be in this haul. I don't know. And this one is honey. I don't have my glasses on. Milk and honey. Not bad for a dollar. It does its purpose. Sorry I put things in bags. I have one person telling me I'm wasting time doing that. It's just what I do. I can't help it. That's the way I am. And... Oh yeah, it is in here, by the way. I just fill it up in here. And I have one that's a toothbrush holder, but I took the top up and then put all my makeup brushes in there. So, this, I don't have a baby, but I use this for my water bottles I bring to the gym or like when I go for my walks. I don't think it's a name brand, it's just called Baby King. Baby King is a name brand because I used to sell this when I worked in the drugstore. I remember Baby King. That or they went out of business. I don't know. And I bought the LEDs. These do not last as long as they make it out to. 
but it does its purpose. It's 60 watt if you're interested. And my husband must my husband picked these up because he always run out of my I bought a Sharpie. I wish they would have had little ones that are in between this size, but I guess this is the size they probably make for them. That's why I got them there. And it's for the fall. I always buy these bell things and I never find them when I need them. So, you know, I'm going to buy a tote and put all of it. I have them in boxes, but I totally get to kind of have an idea what's in there. And let me see what's in this last bag. This I got yesterday. I, I figure I might use this for Thanksgiving. Like to put crackers and cheese or whatever I'm going to do with or any kind of pastry maybe. I love these things. And they hold up pretty good. I mean, some people probably throw theirs away, but they think they hold up pretty good. You might get a few pounds out of it. A few seasons out of it. And I also went to Five Dollar Below. The thing, I don't have anything against Five Dollar Below, but my thing is why they call it Five Dollar Below. Mostly everything is not under Five Dollars there. Some things are. But now they're doing things that are eight and ten dollars or eleven dollars. I don't know if it was eleven, but I remember it's eight and ten. And it's like maybe you should change the the name to five and more <laughs> below. I don't know. There should be no below. I just feel like they should change the name because it's like the Dollar Tree charging you three dollars or two dollars, you know? I don't know. It's a thing. And I'll be right back with that. Alright, then pause it. I left it on the other side of the bed, and my dog. If you ever hear jingling, that's my, my chihuahua. Uh, my husband picked this. He knows, like, the right size and everything. It's a tour of a, a charger, the cord. Type-C cable, heavy-duty. And I have a moto. Those of you who have a moto. These work pretty good. I got one from a Dollar Tree with the... The one that, the part that plugs in, I don't know what you call it, excuse me, not being tech savvy. I can know, I get around pretty good, but my husband knows the proper words. Um, this is 10 foot, I don't know if I said it, but the one I got at the Dollar Tree runs short, but it lights up, it's good at night, so you can see what you're doing. It's really good. It's pink, if you see it, grab them, they're not bad for in between, you know. But these I usually get there, and they, they do the purpose. I'm just curious to tie the stick on. I know this one's probably worth five dollars. I think. My husband. Oh, the receipt case. Let's see how much. The store is just. Yeah, five ninety five. See, everything's one in five dollars. That I could take, but but the five dollar below when things are eleven dollars, I don't know. They they think they need to reword the sign. It's like when they had dollar stores that said a dollar and then dollars, I mean, uh, I'm blabbing on, I don't know, there's certain dollar stores that will say another word to make a dollar or more. I've seen stores like that. I get that, but this, I saw, maybe I'm just being stupid about it, I don't know. So that's it with my haul, and please subscribe, I appreciate it if you're interested in me. And give me a thumbs up and a comment, that, com, com, comment. Because it really helps with the algorithms because if you don't get enough of that, your videos won't be shown as often like the others. So, see you real soon. Bye!